Hey guys, I am just leaving work, Fearless Family, and we're going to do a little chat, chatting about some stuff I seen on social media while I was working, okay? All right, so we're going to get started on this because let me see how much time I got left on this phone. I had to clear up some storage. All right, I don't want it to cut off on y'all, so let's get to it, Fearless Family. Click that button, click that subscribe button so you can be part of the fam, okay? So, everybody's doing a video about this couple, and I'm just, I'm not going to call them out, and I'm saying right now, as a disclaimer, I'm not accusing anybody of anything, but when you put yourself out there and things happen, you become a product of uh, discussion. Okay, you got this couple that has a set of twins. They have two sets of twins. So this couple, I recently started watching because it just started popping up. I'm not subscribed, um, but it just started popping up. So they're in their third set of twins. So I was like, hmm, interesting, okay? So boom, they take you through this whole pregnancy spiel, um, which is normal. If I if I was pregnant, I would do a whole thing of a juggler for y'all, you know? <clears throat> so they take you through this whole pregnancy spiel all the way through their journey which is normally what people do and of course those type of videos get a lot of views a lot of reviews a lot of support especially when you're having twins especially when you're having your third set of twins okay so <clears throat> where i got thrown off at was i only seen the last two video two or three videos so i seen the one where they were moving feel like my tire was doing something where they were moving to a bigger place and then i seen the one where she was like in pain you know pre-labor getting ready for labor getting ready for delivery or whatever and then they filmed her delivery live all the way up to the legs up in the air live okay i would have been like husband no um i'm just a little bit more private than people i'm not judging y'all not gonna see my legs opening up in the air on youtube you're not gonna do it unless i'm getting pizzayed like got shoulder for it okay so anyways, <clears throat> they do the delivery, they do the delivery live, they abrupt, abruptly cut it off, but they said live delivery of the twins, not clickbait, and then they cut it off, but they gave you enough of it, okay. So then they come back, oh, we're no longer having a third set of twins, click, click, not clickbait, no longer having a third set of twins. I felt bad, click the video. The whole video, they just stringing you along. Things happen, things, we'll talk about it when we're ready to talk about it. You know, things, you know, she's very exhausted. She, let me tell y'all something. I'm an influencer and I'm a YouTuber. So I feel like I'm talking about myself and it's okay for me to say this. And I'm not judging the son, not going to let y'all be my friend. I'm not judging anybody. But let me tell y'all something. That didn't help. If I lose a child. I will not be on here the next day. Y'all will probably go about a week wondering where I'm at. I'm not judging anybody for the record. I don't know. Y'all not be able to see me because, baby, South Florida is not playing. Um, it's just like people that come on crying. Like, I'm not going to come on here crying. I may start crying during the video when I do that type of video, but... I just don't think those type of things are genuine. I really don't. For you to get up the next day and do a video, but do a whole 30 to 45 minute video and not say nothing. Nothing, but there were some complications. There were some complications. We'll talk about it. Da, 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 da. No, we need to be sitting there crying, supporting each other, figuring out what we're going to do. This is my first time losing a baby. I have to have a funeral for this baby, all this other kind of stuff. So I didn't think it was genuine when they was doing that. And then they came back again, did another video in the hospital before she got released or whatever. And then they came back again and did the on the way home. That might have been all in one video, the on the way home. So I was like, okay, I'm done with it. You know, I'm done with it. So they only have one baby. And, and you know, and now they're stringing along what happened. What happened? Of course, all, all the nosy people in the world 
Of course, the views are up. The ratings are up. Everybody wants to know what happened. Everybody feels bad. Okay, I'm not knocking it, but y'all got to pimp game when y'all see game. I'm sorry. I've seen a couple of other videos about this situation. I'm not the first person to do a video about this situation and this person. Um, and everybody's saying the same thing. They feel like it, there was never twins. There was never a third set of twins. And they got strung along for the ratings, for the views, for the whatever. Now they finna get even more popular because you got more people tuned in on a traumatic loss. You know, and I feel the same way. Now, Father, forgive me if I'm wrong. But I feel the same way. I feel like there were no twins to begin with. I feel like there were there they have two sets of twins. And it was a good uh, scheme and promotion. Now, I did not go all the way back to see what they showed in ultrasounds and stuff like that as far as ultrasound pictures and doctor's visits. So, I could be wrong. But I'm not the only one saying this. This is why I came and did the video. Because I'm not the only one saying this. And I thought this as soon as they did that because of how quick they came back on talking about some complications. So, you know, I, I am not judging I am not passing judgment if they lost a child God bless from the bottom of my heart my video was basically for to say that my fearless family my friends my subscribers or whatever I I don't clickbait scam spam y'all people do clickbait to get the clicks because we get money maybe that's why I'm not getting the views I'm supposed to get maybe that's why I'm not getting the check that everyone else is getting but I'm not going to do that for instance, the one lady I told y'all about before, she talking about her daughter and how her daughter's put out and how her daughter don't have nowhere to go and how her daughter got five kids and the baby daddy beat up and she needs somewhere to go. And through YouTube, she raised thousands of dollars. But her next video was a Louis Vuitton luxury shopping video. And then the video after that was her remodeling her whole patio. And the video after that was her going on vacation. Out of, the, out of the state, vacation, cruise, vacation thing. Why you can't take care of your own kids? It's not my responsibility. I, okay, give me the sob story. That's vlogging. Vlogging, you're supposed to see what's really going on. I'm Gucci with that. But at the end of the day, if you can remodel your patio and you can go to Louis Vuitton and shop, it's $2,000 $2, for a Louis Vuitton bag. Why couldn't you... Get that get that two thousand dollars to your daughter and let her get somewhere to stay for you and your grandkids. Not only that, you done moved six times since I've been watching you in the span of two years. Why you couldn't get a two bedroom and let her move with you for a while? Or well, I think she already had a two bedroom. Why your daughter couldn't come stay with you and get on her feet? You know what I'm saying? Like I don't really go for all of that stuff. I don't really, like, you gotta, I, I'm sorry if I'm that way, but people get scammed. People get set up. People, there are people out here that do stuff to get the money, to get the views, to get the gifts. I'm appreciative of everything that I receive. I will promote your business if you send me your stuff, and I don't charge you anything. I don't charge anything unless if I'm reached out to for a collaboration that has a percentage, then fine. But a lot of small black businesses, little businesses, people making body oils, hair oils, lotions, candles, send it to me. I'm not going to charge you anything. Now, if you, we want to get onto something together, we can do that. But firstly and initially, I'm not charging you nothing. I'm not. I'm, I'm here for you. If something happens in my life, I'm going to tell y'all something happened in my life. But I'm not going to do it for the... What I, what I want to say for the fan base maybe you know I don't know what y'all think and if y'all follow these people and this couple tell me what y'all think down below I like I said once again before somebody who is not paying attention to the words that are coming out of my mouth go down below with some bull clap because I claps back I'm not judging I'm not accusing I'm saying what it looks like and not just to me it is looking this way to a lot of people, okay? And I am saying that I genuinely don't care for people that have a tragedy and they are on the next day. I have pre-recorded video. Maybe I'm just an emotional person because I have pre-recorded videos saved for days that I just weeks 
days that I just cannot get on here. This is not easy. I love doing it. It's a hobby. But there's some days that my mood, my energy, my aura, I'm going through. And I, I'm not going to get on here crying to y'all and telling y'all what I'm going through. So, but, you know, I understand what's going to get me people. Drama. Lies. Trauma. BS. I got a clown. I got to act the fool. I'm not that type of person. So if my channel doesn't make it to the 100,000 or the 200,000, then that's the way the universe wants it. I'm just not the type of person to give y'all every tragedy in my life just to get followers, just to get likes. I rather the people that are coming to my channel to watch me are coming because I'm genuine, because they like what they see. You know, I, I take video requests. I'm open to whatever type of videos y'all think I should switch it up, change it up and do. I don't do political. I don't because my opinion is my opinion and yours is yours. And I, I don't feel like I have the right to tell you who you need to be. I don't do political. And I normally don't do little videos like this, but it depends on what it is. And I don't call people out. I'm not calling them out if y'all know who they are is because you following them and you watching them and you think probably thinking the same thing or wondering like what's going on. But my thing is, I'm just wondering, is it real? And I'm going to wonder that when you have a tragedy of a death of a child that you carry for nine months, a newborn, an unexpected death, and the next day you on here, and I didn't see no tears. If y'all saw tears, go down below and tell me you saw a tear so I could go back and check for the tear. I didn't see no tears. I saw the, 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 the sadness and the please bear with us. We're very emotional right now. I saw that. I saw that. I saw that. You know, the husband did most of the talking, talking about there was some complications and can y'all pray for them and bear with them. And you know what? At the end of the day, to all of you people who give to people like that, God bless you and you will be blessed. My mother used to say that I get, that she gives to people and if they do wrong with the money, then God will handle it and God will handle them. And I do believe that. I just think it's wrong to kind of trick people. I'm going to use the word trick. I think it's wrong to kind of trick people into getting certain things. But this world is full of con artists. This world is full of fake. This world is full of trickery. So I do know what type of world we live in. But y'all just let me know what y'all think. It's not like going to Office Depot right quick for my job. But I just had to come do that video. And I am wondering what y'all think about it. So hit your girl up down below.